The band was on an old raggedy bus, but he had a small Learjet, and that's what he used to go from town to town. We get off work after a really good show, and he'll say, we're going to rehearse, and rehearse until about 3 or 4 o'clock in the morning, and he would go to the hotel and go to sleep and then fly to the next job. And all of us would have to then get on the bus. Every once in a while, he would cherry pick a musician from the band to fly with him to the next town. Gertie, she come look for me after every show. The boss wants you to fly with him. I'm like, ah, oh, man. Because he was like your uncle or your dad or something, you know, like he was cool. But he wasn't the guy you hang with, you know. And he'd get me up there in that air, man. He'd get to talking about stuff that I really didn't want it. girls and stuff like that. I'm like, yeah, whatever, man. I want to play some music. Then he would strike up a conversation about going back, you know. Like he would say, like, I can't go back to that. I ain't going back to that now. I'll kill myself before I go back there. We up in the air at 30,000. And I'm like, come on, dude. You know, I'm like killing yourself, man. I'm, I'm, I'm up in this air with you like that, you know. So then after a while, I'd hide. I would hide until he was gone. Like that. Your mother! 